again, back in that sweet spot, finds himself, times it, and gets piped as he comes through that inside corner right there. Gets rewarded with a really big score, a nine point ride. This wave was large and in charge. And so to have the wherewithal to slowly edge your way into it and ride that inside rail, pushing hard to make sure that he makes it as he engages. It was such a beautiful wave and a well executed tube ride. You know, to make that wave, he really had to push down and come up on the face and then push on that inside rail and engage, which is really hard to do out here. February's wave didn't offer up all the scoring potential that he would have liked as it ran off into the channel. They see the finish. Just didn't, didn't give him much. Let's get to Noe Mars wave. Nine point ride. That was just a ferocious looking wave from the takeoff. 100% committed surfing for Noe Mar McGonagall. Was it the longest tube of the event? But it had so much intensity as he pulled up into the barrel. The judges had no other option. They had to throw out that excellent score. Well earned for Noe Mar McGonagall. And you see more waves pulsing through that classic sunset peak.